Hi, I'm Kevin from DMK Yacht Instruments, and this is a video outlining some tips and tricks for installing your DMK box. First of all, I would recommend installing the box in a warm, dry place aboard the boat, if that is at all possible. If you do have to choose a spot that will get wet and damp, we recommend that you use heat shrink connectors rather than the terminal strip. Because the DMK box works across multiple protocols and can input many different instruments, I recommend using a Numar terminal strip as the connection between the box and the rest of the boat. The strip will allow you to easily connect to the NEMA 2000, SeaTalk, and ON83 ports that are installed on the DMK box. It'll, it will also allow you flexibility when instruments break or when you want to change to a newer protocol. Install the box somewhere that is easily accessible where you can see the LEDs without too much effort. The box is not pretty so we also recommend that you install it somewhere that can be hidden easily without effort as well. Please strip only the wires that you intend to use with your instruments. Stripping all the wires can allow for wires to touch that were not intended which will do damage to your DMK box. When connecting the ground there are two ground wires on the DMK box. The black and the white wires. Uh, we recommend that you connect both of these wires in the same spot aboard the vessel. Where you connect them ultimately will depend upon the instruments that you are connecting to. Whenever you are installing your DMK box, realize that we have published the wiring diagram on one side of the DMK box and we have published my phone number on the other side. If you have any questions or want to contact us for support, don't hesitate. We're happy to help you out and make you a happy customer.